Welcome to Tour Rosso. Well, we're going to go on a bit of a factory tour and have a look at what goes on behind the scenes. You've got a camera there, so I can take some of these images. So we go. This is where the magic happens. This is where it all gets designed. Yeah. <laughs> the thing is, these cars are so integrated in the way the architecture works. So suspension's got to complement aerodynamics, for example, because they influence each other. The aerodynamic tends to dominate what we do, and that's where the shape of the car gets defined. And that shape then gives you the architecture of the car. You can see here the front wing, and then a 2D drawing comes from this. So the design process on CAD is giving you the geometry, but the engineering behind it needs to show how it's assembled. To convert all the designs into a computer file which the machines understand, and this is CAD CAM, all these guys are setting up the correct computer instructions for the machines to work to. So we're down here in the lower floor where we have the machine shop. We machine metallic parts here, but we also make some of the carbon fiber molds and tooling as well. The car is predominantly structurally composite. In fact, last year we produced over 77,000 individual composite parts. They're big machines, right? Well, you've got things the size of a floor or a chassis. You have to have almost a room that you can go into to machine it. So they have to be this size for the big parts. The carbon fiber itself is actually kept in a freezer. It's kept in a freezer. The freezer has to be frozen because it's got a life. Well, it's got a sell-by date. It's got a sell-by date, exactly. Oh, wow. And once it's cooked, it's then this incredibly light, very stiff, very, very strong material, which is why we use it. These are called autoclaves. And so this uh, is where the parts are cooked? This is where they're cooked. See, they're pretty big. It looks like a submarine, but that's because it has to be pressurized. Yeah. OK, then we have this really clean environment, which is the quality control. We have all the parts checked in here. So this is a hub, a wheel axle, and this machine is working through all the critical dimensions of that hub, so we'll have a CAD model of the dimensions to work to. And this here is non-destructive testing or NDT, which looks for the structural robustness of a part which has already been used, so it's an ongoing process. When things are quality controlled, they are then released to either be put onto the car or assembled as something else. So it's being built over there, so we won't film that because as long as the body works on, you can see everything inside. I can see that's going well, so that's good news. Is even the suspension made from carbon fiber? Yep. Even the pedals? Yep. So that's a wishbone, and that's carbon fiber. And these are the pedals, and that's carbon fiber as well. And then you end up with a car. The course is a bit more complicated <laughs> than that. So. How long is that process normally? We tend to start the next year's car at the end of the previous year but once. That design process starts very early to look at new ideas that you haven't got time to incorporate in your current car. I think that gives a pretty good overview of everything. We can have our camera back now. <laughs>